The, um, the overall purpose of our makerspace is to create a culture of making at Blue Valley North. Hive 18 is Blue Valley North's makerspace and we call it the beta. Um, it was actually a student design project. Uh, we were looking at, um, it was my graphic design two class, we were looking at spaces around the school that were being underutilized and could add functionality to them. So students in that class worked on branding and they came up with a concept for how a makerspace could be beneficial to Blue Valley North. Um, Charlie Matson is the one who designed the logo for it and that class came up with the idea of the beta because when you're in beta testing, things are always in process. And so we wanted to demonstrate that things that happen in that room are constantly in process, that um, we might fail, but that's okay because there's always opportunities to try again and test things out. So um, over the last two years, Graphic Design 2 classes have been working on making that space even more functional. Uh, so we painted the room, we got new furniture in the room, um, we've been working with our administration and district office to provide more funding so that we can bring that into a fully functioning makerspace. So we've got plans to add a 3D printer down there and and um, buy some more supplies and be able to use that room throughout the school year next year. So some of the features right now, um, that room, because we've had limited funds so far, um, we've been using money from the Blue Valley Educational Foundation grants. Um, we've been able to buy things like um, lo-fi prototyping materials. So we've got like cardboard and Play-Doh and pipe cleaners and Legos and those kinds of things where it's really easy and quick and not too messy to build things. Um, we also have all kinds of circuitry down there. So we have like raspberry pies and um, three doodlers. We've got like a little synthesizer down there that you can make beats and stuff with. Um, we also have our vinyl cutter down there. So students have been making t-shirts and using our vinyl cutter, they've been making stickers and all kinds of fun stuff. We've got the button maker. So um, earlier this year, we used that to make um, 1,600 buttons for the whole school for our Please Stay um, Suicide Awareness campaign. Um, so those are the things that we have down there right now. But like I said, we're hoping to expand our options even more. One of the things that we're working on is developing a strategy for supervision for that space. So we're currently open Mondays, Tuesdays, and Fridays during North Time. Um, we also have the room open during second hour um, during my graphic design two class so kids can go down and make things. Um, next year we're going to be expanding our supervision so we will have that room staffed for four hours during the day. So we are inviting classes and students uh, and teachers to come down and utilize that space for class projects, for individual projects, um, for all kinds of things. And then it should be open during North Time as well. We want students to be able to come down there and experiment in tangible ways and be able to try out ideas, um, to be able to express themselves, to be able to make whatever it is that they want to make and um, be able to do that whenever they want to.